this boy through ain't gonna come through at all. So, 45. Slap came out to triple eight, 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 eight is how it goes. Triple eight, uh, Chinese restaurant. I had the urge to go ahead and try some Chinese food today. I wanted to do something a little different. And I'll let you know how it comes out later in a little bit. But these are some of the picks. And if you've never been there, this is right there. If you take the Almedo, actually, you can take going south on 45. Gulf Freeway, you can take Fuquay. I took the Almeida and came by way of Almeida Mall. It's not very far from there, and to me, I really enjoyed it. So let's just stand by one and uh, enjoy the pics, and I'll catch you at the end of the video. And I hope you guys catch uh, caught that other video that I need y'all to watch for uh, your chance to enter for, uh, I believe, you know, a gift card or something, right? Follow the video, follow the rules. So there you have it. That was triple eight and uh, eight eight eight, or however you want to say it, tres ochos or whatever. <laughs> I think so. And uh, that was triple eight Chinese restaurant. And to be exact, to tell you exactly where it's at. It is at one two three four six Gulf Freeway. And the uh, thing that I saw was the lunch hour. I, I ordered off the lunch menu. And I don't know if y'all saw, if you look at the plate, the plate was pretty big. I mean, it wasn't like a whole lot of variety, but I got, you know, the egg roll came with it. So you got the egg roll, you got the, I, I ordered general so chicken. All right, so TSO, everybody tends you know, pronounce it different, to so or whatever, How, yeah, whatever you want to call it. But there's a spelling there. General so chicken, that's how I was told it was pronounced. And... I ordered off the lunch menu, and that's uh, usually, I think it's Monday through Friday. And lunch menu is from 11 to 4. So 11 to 4, 
if you get a chance to go by that place at 11, uh, there's a receipt. You see the receipt? I mean, God, I was kind of amazed at the end, man, when they gave me that. Luckily, I just ordered, I ordered water. I didn't order anything else. I don't drink soda water, so. And Chinese food and a beer for me, wasn't gonna work. I had to go with the water. And uh, $12.18 was the total. I mean, you tell me. I don't know, maybe that's high to some people, but for some places that I've gone and that I go to and you know, when I do go out to eat, some prices are pretty high right now. Especially now, you know, because you know, inflation is a little high right now. And, and that's why, in a sense, I kind of slowed down the uh, recons because uh, the, the budget was kind of like getting a little out of hand. So I had to slow it down just a little bit, just to build up some funds. We're there now. And I uh, hope you liked that video. And... I'm thinking maybe, hold on, I'm thinking maybe that, you know, you're not, a, you, you may not be a Chinese food, so we do it with your lid, her, whatever word you want to use. And then there's the uh, lunch and dinner. I don't do lunch and dinner too much. I'm going to start doing it because sometimes these restaurants have a lot more to offer other than just white with and cheddars. And I know that I've been, I've been, it's been mentioned to me that I should try something and you're right so we're gonna go ahead and start working on that and that's kind of why i started changing with today's you know this option here for chinese food i said you know what i'm gonna go there it's gonna be during the lunch hour or after the lunch hour i kind of shot in there about 1 to 1 30. says on the receipt i didn't read it but it was a good time there wasn't a lot of people in there it was perfect because usually that place has a crowd i mean you can drive by there on any given day and they got a crowd and don't even try it on the weekend you want to go and film a video or whatever don't don't even on a weekend don't even try it so those of you who want to try doing video or youtubing or whatever never on a weekend let's see i think that's all i had here get your name in for the the giveaway so friday i'll be announcing the name and good luck to whoever gets it and uh the next one's going to be a better one I just had to start out this way and remember what I said, things are going to be different. But I hope you caught that video. You have to catch the video that tells you about the giveaways. I can't, I can't mention them in every video because, uh, you know, that video there, you have to go back to it and you talk, you, I mean, you get the info from there and then you'll know. Plus, do me a favor, subscribe or get your friends to subscribe. And if you are already a subscriber, I thank you and I appreciate you for doing so. And please tell your friends, get, bring your friends involved. Because the more people we get in here, the more giveaways we can do. And, and I mean that, you know, sincerely. And this to me is all about getting you guys to be involved and for me to try to give y'all the information that, that y'all might want to have uh, for some of these restaurants. Also, give me some ideas on where you think I should go, okay? I'm doing that one now. So this one's, this is the announcement for that one. If you tell me a restaurant where you think I should go and you are a subscriber and in that video it's going to tell you how I know if you're a subscriber or not. So if you're not a subscriber, don't bother. But if you are a subscriber, uh, please go ahead and uh, tell me where you think. What is the next restaurant you think I should go to? And if I go to it, then you will also get a gift card. Those are only going to be $25 gift cards though. Those won't be you know, anything more than that. So. Thanks again for watching. I appreciate all of you. Really appreciate you. And I ask, and I ask that you please um, get me some subscribers. We got to move this. We got to keep it going. Also, Explain Strange. Explain Strange is getting ready. It's kicking off its big deal. So this year of 2024, I'm going to give it all I got. And maybe it's my last year on this earth. I really don't care. I'm not scared. It doesn't bother me. I'm going to give it all I got. Or all that I can with the time that I have because no one was told this I didn't say anything but I did take on a part-time job I wasn't going to but I decided eh, what the heck I'll go ahead and do it got kind of bored so thanks again have a great one uh, appreciate it turn of the towers don't forget uh, st. Jude uh, children's research and then wounded warrior project Support these organizations, please. I'm a veteran. Them veterans need your help. Do what you can for them. And if I'm talking too loud, it's because my ears are muffled with this thing here. I'm, I got a new setup going here, and I bought different equipment. Then I got some other stuff getting ready to use for the podcast. Remember, catch the podcast. 
Gonna be good. We got the Curious Twins gonna be on there. I don't know if you guys know who they are. You might want to check them out. They're out of San Antonio and they do a lot of ghost hunts. These guys have done, I don't know, several. I mean, I'd like to say hundreds, but I, I don't know that I can say that because I don't, I don't know the exact number. We will know in the podcast, but we're gonna ask them. So thanks a lot. Have a great, great one, and uh, good luck, and congratulations ahead of time to one to the one that's going to win. Because Friday I'm going to pull your name, who did what they were supposed to do, and then you're going to get that. You know what was on that back shelf back there? That's the shelf. I hope you caught it. All right, that's it. Slap is out. <laughs>